Hi, Sean Vincent here from Silver Bow Fly Shop in Spokane, Washington. If you're new to fly casting, I have two very important casting pointers for you today. The first critical piece to the fly cast is that the rod tip travels in a straight line back and forth. Remember, the line and fly always follow the path of the rod tip. So if you arc your rod through the air, your line and fly are gonna follow that path. You'll have these great big open loops. It's not very efficient, and you're gonna have a really hard time loading and unloading the rod. Straighten out that rod tip. That all translates from a straight hand and a straight rod tip movement. That will help tighten up the loops. It'll help you come to the complete stop. It'll help the loops turn over and it'll help you create line speed. The other key piece to fly casting is casting in a straight plane, back and forth. Now, without trying to hit my cameraman here, I'm gonna cast straight at the camera. Notice that the rod and, the, and my arm are tracking in one plane. The straighter that rod and arm track back and forth, the straighter that line will lay out in front of you. So remember, two key pieces to fly casting. The rod tip travels back and forth in a straight plane. That all relates to what your arm and hand are doing. And also tracking that rod back and forth in one plane. That will also lead to straight line cast. Don't hook the rod. Just cast nice and straight. It doesn't have to be straight up and down like a robot. It could be at any angle, but it's in one plane. Hope that helps. If you have any questions, check us out at silverbowflyshop.com.